Well, how are you doing? Uh, I'm Kerry Brand. I'm uh, with Plantronics. I have uh, Joe Stahula up here with me. Um, we're here. Uh, oh, I don't have any slides either, so just letting you know. Uh, we're actually going to do a, a live demo of a something that we're very excited to actually announce here. Is this? Um, well, let me let me just show you. So this here is a well, what looks like to be a I guess a headset. Uh, this actually looks a lot like our Voyager Legend, which is uh, a smart sensing headset, easy to integrate with applications. Um, but the innovation team, which is the team behind PLT Labs, uh, pltlabs.com, is, is really about, uh, let's just say, augmenting and, and tweaking uh, our wearable technology. So this headset's got a little bit more horsepower in it than, uh, than uh, than what's out on the market today. And in fact, I would conjecture to say this is a very interesting wearable concept that we're showing you today. Uh, inside of it, uh, we do still have the capacitive sensors uh, that, are, that we're known for, for smart sensing. We've also put a nine axis um, accelerometer uh, gyroscope as well as a compass inside of this device. So it's, got, it's packing a lot of horsepower. We've also created APIs for this device uh, to I'm going to set this down here for a second. We've also created APIs for the device to actually allow access across multiple platforms, iOS, uh, Windows, Android, and uh, this is really, um, as well as Mac, uh, this is really just a sneak peek at what's going to happen at our keynote tomorrow. So we're going to give you a really abbreviated version of, of some of the, the capabilities of this device. So I've got Joe here with me. Um, so Joe, why, why, don't you, why, don't you put, why don't you go ahead and put this on? And I'm going to plug in something to... Uh, Very light and feels just like my favorite headset, the Voyager Legend it, I use every day. It looks pretty fantastic. You're a handsome man. Okay, so this here is our um, IO, uh, this is a, uh, an iPad mini, uh, and it's kind of dirty with my fingerprints, so I'm, we're not going to see that. I'm going to plug it in here to the VGA system. Okay, so are you looking, you were looking that way. All right, so what we're going to show you first is Joe's true self. Can we get to... Uh, Switch to this key? Yep, there we go. So, let me calibrate again here. There we go. So, so that's being streamed from the wearable... Am I still a handsome man? You, you, are, you are looking good. Um, data's being streamed right now from the wearable device over Bluetooth, and it's connecting with something called MFI, which is made for iOS. It's a chipset that allows us to natively connect over Bluetooth and transmit data to, to, the, uh, to the iPad here. Um, so there's, there's a couple of other features uh, that we put in there. It's not just about head orientation. It's about getting access to that data. But uh, there's a couple of other sensors here. So I'm going to pretend, or Joe's going to pretend, like he's walking through the park here, and I'm going to switch panels on us. Um, we should be able While to I'm see... While I'm listening to music from my fully functional headset. Oh, a absolutely. It is a fully functional headset. So hopefully, uh, you know, Joe, you're just not walking hard enough. We need, we need some more, uh, we need some more step in here. Or perhaps not. So we do have a built-in pedometer functionality, and this is real. There so you can... Oh, there. Hey, look at that. So now we have some steps coming in uh, through our data stream. So again, head orientation, pedometer, and... Uh, you know, I'm not going to ask you to try and jeopardize your life by, you know, slipping through the puddle there, but we also Wind have, water. yeah, free fall detection, as you can see there. <laughs> so we have this ability to actually start to augment, uh, you know, Joe's, Joe's experience. Um, another capability of this device is the ability to tap. And again, this is just surfacing the event. So if you tap the headset, um, you should start to see some tapping here. There we go. So we're also exposing tapping. Um, I think the last one here that we're going to, uh, to show as far as demonstrations is, you know, this is a fully functioning headset. It does audio, uh, takes phone calls, all of that. Um, but it's also about delivering like an augmented experience. So you can take the sensor information that's in that very small form factor and overlay it and mash it up with other technologies. So what I'm gonna show you now, hopefully, uh, if this works correctly, is imagine if, um, you know, Joe is walking down the street, he is, you know, lost. I'm not saying he ever gets lost, but perhaps he's lost. And he wants to find out where he's at. So I get a phone call from him. Um, 
And what we can do, and this is a little bit of a preview for tomorrow, is show you kind of how the head tracking information, the compass information, the GPS on his phone, or on this iPad, for instance, can be taken and mashed together to deliver an augmented experience. So hopefully this will work. Allow me to run outside. All right. So what we're seeing here is actually a mashup of Street View with the head orientation information, with the GPS information on the iOS device. So if he looks up, you can see up. You look down, you look down. But that information and that data can be surfaced not only on this device, but it can be surfaced to the cloud and shared across multiple devices. So this device right here, though, is as concept. It's wearable. Um, uh, it's a wearable concept, and in fact, if you are very interested in learning how to perhaps get your hands on one, I would invite you to come to our keynote at lunch tomorrow, where we'll be talking a little bit more about the capabilities of this device, um, as well as you know, some, of, some of the really exciting stuff around wearable technology that we see as Plantronics. Um, I, think that's, I think that's about it, yeah. So um, also we'll have, a, hopefully we'll, we'll sneak by the booth here and we'll put some in the back so you can actually take a look at how this stuff works and play with it yourself. Thanks.